what is up Pisces? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Stella, aka SCLA, aka Fire Box Shop, baby. I hope that each and everyone you're having a very blessed and a beautiful day and that you are saying kind things to yourselves and to others. Before I jump into this reading, I gotta give a quick little disclaimer that I am not legally responsible for anything that you do or do not do based on this reading. This is all strictly advice and suggestion based on what I see in the cards. This is also a general reading. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, which goes way more in depth, and is in tune to your energy specifically, you can do so through my email or through my Etsy shop. And without further ado, Pisces, let's go ahead and jump right in. So let's go over the intuitive messages that I got for you, Pisces. It wasn't a lot, but it was very significant. And then we're gonna go ahead and pull some tarot. So what I saw was a fish, it was like a koi fish, and it was going downstream and it was enjoying this beautiful clear water it was feeling very calm very peaceful and pisces you are the fish so this was very symbolic to your energy and i also saw the hierophant card which is all about self-mastery it's about being in this guru state about knowing that it takes steps it takes time to get to where you're trying to go not trying to rush the process enjoying where you're at on the journey of enlightenment and realizing the connection that you have to your environment feeling your environment truthfully for what it is a reflection of you embodying this whole energy that's just very pure it's very refreshing the water is very it's an emotional outpour of abundant energy right we often relate this outpour of energy as something negative right but it's just over sense it's this over sense of gratitude it's this just very tingly it feels very tingly it feels very sensual it feels very silky okay i also heard that right now is a very important time for you to protect your blessings and to protect your energy is there is a scorpio around specifically a scorpio or somebody who behaves in the way that a scorpio does has a lot of scorpio placements big emphasis on the Scorpio though they are trying to rush you into something that there is just they're not giving you all the details they're trying to attach themselves to you into your blessings because they have a lot of baggage that they don't want to deal with and they want to put that on you they're playing on your vulnerability they're playing on your willingness to be a good person to be very generous and kind and nurturing and they could be presenting this facade to you that they do care that they do want to be there with you that they are a part of your abundant journey but it's all an illusion and don't take this person in and don't take this person seriously they're not giving you all the facts they're not giving you all the information this is just not somebody you want to mess with okay scorpio let's go ahead and jump into the tarot oh i said scorpio we're on pisces Ooh, pisces yep 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 Yep, what did I just say? What did I just say? Two of Cups in reverse, two of Wands, and the Three of Swords. What did I just say? This person is trying to mirror your behaviors and act like you and think that, or not think, they're trying to show you that you have so much in common, that you guys are soulmates, that you guys are twin flames, right? They're giving you this story. They're like, you know, white knight in shining armor, but it's all an illusion. It's all a facade. This person is not good vibes. This person is not good for you at all, Pisces. This could even very well be a family member. But I'm seeing you here standing in your authority, standing on your throne, embodying this Empress energy. This Queen of Pentacles is somebody who is on their job, on a mission, has their plan, has their big goal, has their little goals, has a way to get there, knows their strategy, maybe doesn't have it all the way figured out, but is willing to put the work in, is willing to figure it out day in and day out. Like you are just focused on your mission, on your job, period. You are abundant. You are in your flow state and they know this and they sense it and they want a piece of your cake. They don't even want to come in and give you something that is going to help you. They just want to take, okay? So pay attention to how you feel around certain individuals. If you start to get randomly exhausted around certain people, if you start to feel like a headache or you like, you notice that when you're around somebody, it's hard for you to talk. It's, 
you can't articulate your words correctly, like you kind of feel dumb around this person, it's because this person thinks so poorly of you that they're projecting that energy out. And with you being a super empath, you are absorbing it and you're reflecting that back to them, right? So like, if you suddenly feel ditzy, airy, clumsy around somebody, this person doesn't want you around you, What doesn't want you around them and doesn't like who you are when you're in your purest state of form. So their energy is just coming out, coming at you, okay? So I'm seeing that there's a need to get you some protection crystals and to really just up your protection, up your, get around your house, put some uh, salt around your house, put some, not in the grass though, because we don't want to hurt the worms and the bugs, but like on your windowsill, right? Get some red, red brick dust and what else is good? Black tourmaline is really good. Obsidian is really good. That will pull the energy out of you too. And it'll also protect you from other people's energy as well. So will turquoise. Turquoise is really good for grounding and protection. Okay, without further ado, my beautiful Pisces fish. I'm also seeing amethyst, but don't sleep with amethyst under your pillow. It'll give you weird dreams. But I'm also seeing amethyst for purity and maintaining your energy, okay? But without further ado, my beautiful Pisces fish, if you liked it, if it resonated, go ahead and leave me a thumbs up, comment down below, and I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Peace, love, and light. Bye!